What is up guys, AshBFC here and welcome to the Splinter Cell Double Agent Finale. So we're on the final mission of the game, New York. And it's a pretty long one this, I did consider splitting up into two videos, but I just thought, ah, screw it, go on. we'll just make it one video. So here we go, the final mission. Let's do this. How was Lambert? Dufresne roughed him up pretty badly before you stepped in, but he's expected to recover. Not like some other people. Right, Williams? Fisher, what I did was necessary. This is where it all pays off! All the work, all the sacrifice, it ends here! And we couldn't have done it without you, Fisher! Don't thank me yet! Alright, let's just quickly look at his objectives. Primary, we're going to defuse the first bomb and kill BJ Sykes and Jamie. There's no pausing now because obviously the uh, JBA is on to us. Been exposed. An opportunity there is to neutralize uh, Sykes' men. Not too bothered about the opportunities. But uh, I'm probably going to play a bit more lethal for this final mission. Why not? They're all terrorists, so I'll probably kill most of them. I was the one who kept telling you that. Zip it, dumbass. Can you just tell me to keep the noise down? These guys bickering. Anyway, as soon as he turns round, I'll have to be careful. Sneak on up behind him. Just grab him. See what he has to say. Fisher! It was you all along, you sneaky son of a Think hard about what you're about to say. What do you want? I wanna know where Emil is. He's with the bomb. Where's that? Forget it. You can't get there from here. Not unless you can fly. Well, you can die. Thank you very much. Let's switch to the pistol so we can disable the laser. Now, if you uh, do trick these lasers, uh, there won't be an alarm. There'll be an explosion, which will result in your death. So, be careful. Williams, my cover's blown. Emil's instructed his men to kill on sight. Okay, Fisher. Plan B. Cleanup mission. Take them out, every single one of them. The main JBA members are top priority, the others only if the opportunity presents itself. I'm sending other units, but they may not arrive in time. The Red Mercury devices must be recovered. Hurry, you understand? I'll take care of it. Leave no one standing. Including Enrica Villablanca. Leave her out of this, Williams. She doesn't deserve this. You have your orders. Either do your job, or I'll have someone else do it. Ah, oh, what a prick Williams is. Knock your building there in the background. This guy's heading my way, not a problem. I'll just sneak around. And jam in the back. Alrighty. I'm going to laser over here. This one doesn't seem to, um. Doesn't seem to be able to disable it for some reason. Alright, why not that time? I've had problems before, like that one's refusing to disable for some reason. I don't know. Well, did it then, so fair enough. Making me look like an idiot. Thanks, game. Right, anyway, we're gonna have a, a lone guard in this next room. Just kind of sneak on up to the door and then just stand beside it because he will see through the door, obviously. Got glass panels. Alright, he should be uh, just about heading in. Yep, there he is. And that room is just covered in bird shite. Look at that. Imagine the smell. Covered in shit. Right, 
just going to wait for him to turn around. Here we go. Just crack open Ugh, the door. Stinks. Yeah, I bet it does, Sam. It's full of bird shit. Do you expect? Filthy bastards. Right, I'll tell you what. Just let him move forward a little bit more. Let's switch on the radio. This is not good. Freak him out a bit. Switch that awful noise off. Alright. If actually we can just break this one, no one's gonna hear it. Speed things along. Oh, I've got a wall mine, let's be careful. Uh, as always, disable it when it's on green. There we go. Slip through this vent shaft. We only have uh, three guys in this next area. We've got two right here, and there's going to be another one around the corner. Gotta be careful here. I think I have to wait for uh, one of them should come all the way around. You know, the PS2 version is missing most of the lighting effects, which makes it significantly harder. So I looked at some. Uh, Xbox uh, gameplay, as I might have mentioned previously, I haven't played the Xbox version in a long time. But yeah, looking at it, it's, it's way more lighting. It's just most of it's missing in the PS2 version. Um, and these areas where it should be lit up, but it's not, it looks dark, even though you're lit up, so you're going to find yourself getting caught. And yeah, I mean, again, it might be an emulation issue, I don't know. I've never actually played the PS2 version on console, I've only played it via the emulator. But, um,. I do. I think actually there was a similar thing with Chaos Theory. I played both versions of Chaos Theory on you know the consoles, and I do remember the uh, I think the PlayStation 2 version was missing some of the lighting effects, so that may be the case. So if you are going to play Double Agent, uh, go for the Xbox version if you can. It's got all the proper lighting. Looks a lot better as well. This guy to turn around. Off he goes. What was that? I think I saw it too. I don't like. What's going on here? I'm not entirely sure how they saw me there. I wasn't looking at the meter. They possibly I was a little bit lit up there, even though it did look like it was dark. But that's what I've just been talking about with the missing lighting. I may have counted as a body found. I don't give a shit at this point. It's the final mission. Let's just get it done with, you know. I think it will have been. Oh, yeah, pop that guy in the head. Otherwise, he will go around that corner and he will definitely see the bodies, so. Right, let's disable this uh, turret. There we go. Right, actually, now I'm going to. Um, I'm going to head on back around this way. Through the bird shit room. Right, another laser. Let's take that out. Alright, you can, uh, for instance, like Sticky Shock, the guy up above, but it's very likely he'll fall off, go crashing down below, which obviously will be a body found. Uh, sometimes he might stay up there, um, but more often than not, he falls down from my experience, so uh, I think I'll take this guy out below first, then I'll uh, take the guy out top, and hopefully he will fall off, just for entertainment purposes.
I just need an opportunity to be able to grab this guy. You can see it's quite lit down here below. Looking hard to tell really where I can go without being seen. Yep, see. Ah, oh, he's already coming down the ladder. Yeah, I thought he'd probably good chance he'd hear that, but I thought I'd be able to um, shoot him before he come down the ladder. But he was too far forward, so. I'll shoot him anyway. Ruining my fun. Yeah, this is the other route you can come, but obviously I went all the way around because it's easy, I think, to sneak through that way. So you be lit up when you come through this doorway. Hell down. Now what? Sam, good buddy. What are you up to? About 30 floors. How about you? Just hanging out. I heard you might be feeling lonely, so I thought I'd give you a call. It's good to hear your voice. It'd be better if you knew anything about diffusing red mercury devices. There, my friend, you're in luck. All you have to do to get into their systems is use your EEV. Bingo, you've got remote access. You're a lifesaver. Hey, it was my turn. Alright, so here they both are. And yet we've got to kill them both. Come on, grab him, Sam. There we go. Hello, Jamie. Sam! Man, I'm glad I found you. You don't need to do this, Sam. I wasn't gonna kill you. I know Emil has got it wrong. Actually, he doesn't. What? No. I'm afraid so, pal. But... Why? We were friends, man. I'll let you think that. You're lying, Sam. I know you. We bled together, man. You don't know me, Jamie. You never did. Good night. Uh. Yep, you've no choice but to kill him. Mm -hmm. you know, if you, you know, press the button to chalk them out, you'll still kill them, so... Just so you know, I did screw with your computer. Fisher, don't kill me, man. I'm just a techie. I'll make you a deal then, techie. Tell me something useful, and I'll forget how much I'd like to hurt you. There's nothing I can tell you. We got the same briefing. You know everything I do. Then I guess I don't need you alive. Come on, Fisher. Please, don't. Sorry. Got you die. I was actually hoping that he wouldn't have heard that. I didn't think he would. That's why I pulled him back there and I was going to uh, climb up there and pull him over. But, uh, oh well. Right, let's uh, defuse the bomb. Easy one, that. Done. Sam! Enrico. Gotta hand it to her. She got timing. I think as you saw that uh, this cable magically appeared there. The fuck, Sam? 
Don't climb over the thing. Jump on the zip line. Thank you. Alright, on to the second part. The hardest part for sure. Looked a bit of a rough landing there. Attention everyone, we are not getting any response from Team 3. Repeat, Team 3 is lost. Caleb? Yeah, Moss? Disable the breakers. You got it. Breakers disabled, Moss. Emergency lights activated. Team 2, switch to night vision goggles and stay alert. Assume that there are hostiles nearby. Sweep your areas and report in on the private channel. So, yep, uh, they've knocked out all the lights. So, yeah, they've got night vision, so we can no longer hide in the shadows. We'll be hiding in the light. Let's pick this. Hurry. Come on, you awkward bastard. Sam? Wherever Emil is, you know what I have to do. He wants me to shoot you. I don't think I'm gonna do that. So what are you gonna do? No, Sam. The question is, when all this is over, what are we gonna do? When I figure it out, I'll tell you. I have to go or Emil will get suspicious. His team is on the roof. Moss is on the 68th floor. Good luck, Sam. Enrica. Bye. Alright, now time for the hard part. So we're gonna have two guys in this area. Okay, who's the dumbass who set off the sprinklers? Ah, I wet now. For God's sake, it's just a little water. Stop whining. We're gonna freeze our tails off when we go back out there. If you want, you can stay behind and get nice and warm. Yeah, that's real funny. Right, let's grab this guy. Remember, they got night vision on, so they can spot you straight away. We are not hidden in this darkness. So be very careful. All right, we're not going to interrogate. We're just going to kill. Oh no, I choked him out. Oh, whatever. Alright, we got some, uh... I see ammo there. There's a frag grenade in the room behind there, but... I don't want no frag grenade. I use frag grenade and splint this hell, get out of here! Alright, that guy, um, he should be on his way back now, down this corridor. Yep, here he comes. Just hide behind this wall. Now it's back turned, so let's quickly get on over there. Alright. I've got another laser, I can actually just uh, grab onto this. And climb over. No, you wouldn't be able to use this pipe to take out that guy if you're thinking that. Again, he'd see you. He'd see you straight away. Alright, over the laser. Drop down.
Yeah, we're gonna go come in uh, right this way. I tell you what, let's act very quickly here. Let's get our sticky camera and quickly gas him. He ain't got much time to react there. There's no real place for you to hide. He'll spot you straight away if you just stood here. So I find the uh, sticky camera takes care of him nicely. See where these guys are. We've got two guys. I think one of them should have just gone around the corner. I'll make sure he has gone around the corner before you head out, otherwise, he will see you straight away. As you can see, I stood right in front of this light. My meat is lit up. I'm now completely invisible to these guys. Playing the uh, the opposite way we normally would. The light is now our shadow. I don't know whether these guys are separate. I think I should go around that corner. Wait for this guy to go a little bit further forward. Let's sneak on up. Yeah, I did that. Um, so the guy won't hear him drop. Seem to have very good hearing these guys. And sometimes I've noticed, like, if you go for the lethal um, attack, sometimes a fishery won't, um, like grab them straight away after attacking them, which, you know, you to do that you'd hold the button, but uh, sometimes it's safer just to um, knock them out, because that way Sam definitely will always grab them. Alright, this guy. Alright, actually he's, he's going back down there, so... There we go. Got another wall mine. as well on the shelf if you want to take it. Oh, we've got two guys around this corner as well, this can be a bit tricky this bit. light right here. I'm going to try and grab that guy ahead of me and pull him back around that corner and uh, take care of him. I don't know the other guy see him but I need to know where the other guy is first. Okay there he is. So he should hopefully he'll turn and go back that way. Get up to this guy. Grab him and pull him back before that guy turns round. We haven't got a whole lot of time. He doesn't stay facing that way for long. Again, I'm going to short this guy out just to make sure that Sam um, grabs hold of him for, rather than just dropping him. So that guy doesn't hear. There we go. This guy. Huh? Oof. Okay. Careful here, we've got three guys in this next fact We should have two guys immediately above us. So I'm just going to turn around here, jump on up. You can pull one of them over there if you're quick enough, but the other tool here and you'll have some trouble on your hands, so be careful of that. Alright, I'm going to let this guy go 
who's in front of me and go around the corner. I'm going to go for this guy who's walking away right now. Just grab a hold of him, pull him back. And again, I'm going to choke him just for minimal noise. Pop him down. Alright, now to deal with that guy. Right, let's see what this guy's going to do. The other guy will have gone around the corner into another room, so I don't have to worry about him too much for now. third guy. He'll be in here so I'm going to have to uh, hack this here first. It's a fast one. He's going to have his back to us right here, so not a problem taking him out. Alright, body count rising. Okay, next. Take care of Moss. This is a tricky part. So what we're going to do is we're going to climb up here. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Got the objective there to kill Moss. Yeah, because around this corner um, there's a turret. Yeah, they can see in the dark as well. So I'll put you down as soon as you come around. I guess you could um, put it out with some EMP, but I think it's better to climb up top and avoid it altogether. It's just an easy way of getting into the uh, room, I think. So we've got four guys in total in this next room, including Moss. Right, I'm going to crack out a gas grenade. As I mentioned, I think, in a previous video, it's always risky with the gas grenades. They often give you position away and I'm getting shot, at least in my experience, so I'm not the biggest fan of them. Right there in between those two guys while they're both together. Right, the reason I quickly ran is because it will have gassed those two guys, but because of firing that, there's a good chance the two over there would have seen me. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure I got both of them guys. So, that's two less guys to worry about. It's just how incredibly easy it is to get spotted by. Um, Moss is uh, patrolling little guard right there. Yeah, Moss is the one stood still. Okay, now he's moving, but he should he shouldn't really go too far. He should head back to to his position. Yep, yeah, see, so he ran straight back to his position. See, it's just that guy can spot you from so far away. I'm going to drop down here. Hide behind here. Uh, his friend down.
Okay, I'm gonna stand in this light. I'm just gonna be patient here and see if I can grab all of his uh Of that guard there. Don't really have to worry about Moss, he just kind of stays facing that way. It's just this guy patrolling that's the problem. Alright, he's coming this way. I think I should be able to grab a hold of him. Without Moss seeing. Yeah, okay. Okay. To me, that's the hardest bit of this mission. Definitely, it's the one that's always caused me a lot of problems. Hello, Moose. Fisher. I thought you were keeping an eye on me. I've seen six-year-olds do better surveillance. So I was right about you. None of them would listen to me, you know. You had them all snowed. Emil, Jamie. Don't forget Enrica. Oh, I'm gonna kill you for touching her. Good luck with that. Mm -hmm. Alright, Moss is down. Just take care of the bomb. Next. Alright, to the roof. Go down here. Well, again, we can just break this now. Not to worry about noise. And head to the back here. Place a charge. And quickly head on back out. And blow it up. There we go. And this will take us on to the final section of the game. So all that's left is a meal. So we go over here, we'll have a pipe. So we're gonna climb it up. Drop down. Run over here. Bypass the circuit. Alright, that's gonna send a guy coming uh, down this way. So you don't have to worry about night vision really not wearing it. So you can play the usual game of sticking to the shadows. Making life easier. Alright, this guy loves to take his sweet time, so. Just speed him up and speed it up and um let's go ahead and shock him. Takes forever for him to come down here. Oh poor guy, he fell off. And he got stuck on the pipe below. Sure, we disable this wall mine here, as it will blow up if you ignore it and try to open the door. All right, let's pick this. Come on. 
Hurry. Alright, so we've got two guys in here. Oh, and there's also a turret as well. You'll be able to see it, but it's right over at the back. So you've got to be careful. Alright, this is annoying, this bit. You can't really go too far forward, not just because it's lit, because the turret will start shooting at you. That's an easy way of doing it. I would have rather killed him, but, you know. Climbing up. Just want to really need to uh, deactivate the turret, but uh, I've not actually tried it. But I guess you could try and sneak round the right side there, and then uh, turn the turret on them. Something you could do, I guess. Pretty sure it'd work. seen snow before ever I grew up in Florida not a lot of snow there ah I'm from Colorado we get serious snow out there this this is nothing Again, an easy way of uh, getting the job done there. So you can either go that way through the door or you can go this way. It's basically the same setup, just two guys patrolling. I'm going this way. Alright, so let's quickly get up behind this guy. Bullet in your head, mate. That's what that was. All right, now for the final part. Here we go. Unless I tell you to do so, the next one kills. I want you to very slowly toss your pistol aside. Good. Now tell me, what have you done with the rest of my men? Go check. I'll wait here. Have you killed them then? Men who worked with you? Who trusted you? Spare me the disappointed father lecture, Emil. From the beginning, you were nothing more than targets. And what does that make you? A soldier? A pawn? It doesn't matter. Goodbye, Mr. Fisher. No! Fisher! Okay, here we go, the final shot on with Emil. You can see he's got a big ass machine gun. I don't know why I won't just fight his hand to hand, the basis of all combat. I mean, only a fool trusts his life to a weapon, but whatever. 
See, he can put you down incredibly quick with that thing, so... Don't get hit. I always want to wait for the reload before you move. Otherwise, you're probably going to die. Good idea. Right, so, uh, he disables the lasers while he, you know, moves near him. As you can see, this one went, but we don't want to be going around this side. We want to be going around this side, but... I'm going to roll under that uh, laser right there. That's the plan. And we'll reload. There we go. Just going to hide here. Obviously, I can't disable lasers myself because I ain't got a pistol. Pistol's right there. Go, 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 go! Alright, you can see there's a computer there in the middle. Get access to that. And boom, we can disable lasers. Alright. We now also have a countdown, two and a half minutes. Plenty of time to take this bastard down. Let's go for the next reload and we're going to run into the middle. Go, go, go! And uh, we're going to flashbang this bitch. That's what's going to happen. Eat that. Boom. All right. You can go and pull your pistol if you want. Pop him in the head. But we're going to grab him. See what he has to say for himself. Game over, Emil. Nicely played, Fisher. I don't need your approval, boss. What do you want from me, then? Why not just kill me? I asked the questions. But of course, that is what you do. That is what you are. Nothing but questions. Who are you and what do you believe in? You've walked a long way down our road, Fisher. Even found it in yourself to love one of us. Now why would that be? She is not one of you. You seem so very sure of that. Is it because you simply don't want it to be true? That's not the way the world works. I consider your friend, Mr. Washington, who spoke so passionately on your behalf when you came to us. How many hours did you spend trying to convince yourself he was the enemy? Is he really? Or are you one of us, after all? Shut up. Who is Sam Fisher? Can you answer that one for me? That's enough out of you. Poor Fisher. You can kill me, you know, but you can't silence me. Not now. Not anymore. Well, I can silence you. Because you'd be dead. Alright, last thing to do, defuse the bomb. That's it. Sam, where are you? Is that you? Enrique, get inside now. No. We did good, Sam, didn't we? In the end. Of course, Enrique. Oh, Sam. I'm so sorry. one to collect. We'll find you, Fisher. You can't hide from us. Watch me. I will. 
And there you go, the final mission is complete. See, I didn't do the opportunity objectives right there, because, ah, I don't really care for them. But yeah, oh, two bodies found. Um, yeah, that sounds about right, really. Oh, I'm not too bothered about the last mission. Didn't get spotted, as I said, that was my main thing. Uh, yeah, no alarms either, so... I'll take the two bodies, whatever game, I don't care! We interrupt this programming to bring you a breaking news story. The United States narrowly averted catastrophe today as a three-pronged terrorist assault was foiled. Authorities were able to derail attempts to detonate atomic devices in Nashville, Los Angeles, and Manhattan. The identities of the terrorists are still unknown as no group has stepped forward to claim responsibility for the acts. FBI spokesman Herbert Mangles said today, several devices, which we believe to be nuclear in nature, were recovered before they could be detonated. We are investigating how they were brought into the country and are following every angle. The president praised the preparedness and swiftness of action of the FBI and local authorities, noting that they had saved not only his life, but the lives of millions of Americans. Alright guys, and there you go. That is Splinter Cell Double Agents on the PlayStation 2. So, uh, as always guys, thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the series, and I'll see you all there. Uh,